गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रेन ओपन इंग्लिश सेकेंड बुक लेसन इज लेसन नंबर इलेवन लेसन ने में पास्ट टेंस हियर यू विल नो अबाउट पास्ट टेंस वर्ड्स इन द पास्ट टेंस टेल एस अबाउट एक्शंस दैट टुक प्लेस सम टाइम इगो एक्शंस दैट हैपन इफॉर सम टाइम दैट इज पास्ट टेंस Suppose that example the example is here. I went to the market yesterday. Rahim played tennis with his friends. Here you can see actions that happened before some time. Simple past tense. We add d r e d. to change some words into their past tense forms as you know when we change verbs into simple past then we add their ed you can see hope hoped e hope h o p e hope and we uh, we added here t hoped push pushed Dance, dance. Call, called. You can see at some in some verbs d and in some verbs ed added to make past tense verbs. Now see the change in the spelling of some words when they change into the past tense forms. Some is uh, some words are there. We change only spellings there. You can see ring spelling of ring R I N G in past tense. I replace with a rang ring rang. Find font. Come came. Fly flew. You can see in past tense ring became rang. Find font. Come came. Fly flew. So in this way you will change the spelling. Some words change completely or do not follow any rule while changing. They change into the past tense in irregular ways. Children, a top exceptions in English also, English grammar also. So you can see here without rule, verb is. Changing in past tense, you can see go, went, teach, taught. You will learn this also. Match the words in column A with their simple past tense forms in column B. Now you will match here words that change in simple past tense. Bring. Brought, fold, folded, end, ended, make, met, fall, number five fall, fell, swim, swam, shoot, shot, eat, ate. You can see here ate. In this way, you will change verbs in simple past. And, uh, there should be lot of practice, and you will learn verbs to change their past tense to past tense. Now you can see here. I have given PDF, and you uh, we have done this one also, and this one we have completed already. This one also. Completed. If not complete, complete that from PDF that is our portal. Now no here. Past continuous tense. We use the past continuous tense to talk about an action that was going on the some past of time in the past. Children, see again. Past continuous tense. We use the Past continuous tense 
to talk about an action that was going on at some point of time in the past. What is rule to change the verb in past continuous tense? Now you will know here. We use was where. In past continuous we change. We use was where and add ing to the when uh, to the main verb to change it into its past continuous forms. I was studying last night when the star came. You can see here action that was going on at some point of time in the past. Here you will use with subject was plus verb and in verb you will use ing. I was studying. I was studying last night when the star came. Rohit and Anisha were sleeping when the alarm rang. You can see if noun is similar, you will use was. If uh, noun or subject is a plural, there you will use where and you will add ing in verb. When subject is singular, you will add there. You will use their was plus then plus plus uh, verb and you will use ing. You will add ing in verb. If subject is plural, you will use their where in past tense. Use where plus verb and add ing. Children, learn rules also and we have done this one also already. And this one, if not complete, complete it from portal that is given in PDF. Thank you.